An Israeli airstrike leveled a building in the southern Beirut suburb of Goberi on Tuesday. The strike came 40 minutes after Israeli military Arabic spokesperson Avice Adri issued a warning, claiming the two buildings targeted contained Hezbollah facilities. The building stood in a heavily trafficked area across the street from a large park, which has become a refuge for many displaced families. It is also not far from the French ambassador's residence in Lebanon. No immediate casualties were reported. At the time of the warning, Hezbollah's chief spokesperson was holding a pre-scheduled press conference just a few hundred meters from the targeted area. The event was quickly cut short, with journalists and the spokesperson evacuating the location. The Israeli military did not have immediate comment about the target of the strike. The Israeli military said Sunday it had struck more than 100 military targets in the last day belonging to Hezbollah in southern Lebanon. The army released footage said to show airstrikes on the Hezbollah targets in the area of al Matmura. Israel has meanwhile ramped up strikes on the southern neighborhood of Beirut known as the Dahiyah, a crowded residential area. Hezbollah has a strong presence there but it is also home to large numbers of civilians and people unaffiliated with the Lebanese militant group. A year of escalating tensions boiled over into all-out war last month. Israel sent ground troops into Lebanon at the start of October. Israel's war against Hezbollah, the Iran-backed militant group, stretches far inside Lebanon, and its airstrikes in recent weeks have killed more than 1,700 people, about a quarter of whom were women and children, according to local health authorities. Some of the more than 50 Israelis killed by Hezbollah over the past year were hit by anti-tank missiles. The Israeli military said Sunday that more than 170 rockets were launched from Lebanon at northern Israel. Israeli firefighters worked to extinguish a blaze in northern Israel Sunday after rockets were launched from Lebanon. Israeli police officers were seen next to the site of a fire directing traffic, after an attack in the area near the town of Rosh Pina in northern Israel. The Israeli army updated Sunday that, approximately 160 projectiles that were fired by Hezbollah crossed into Israel. Hezbollah began firing rockets into Israel a day after Hamas' October 7 attack. After nearly a year of tit-for-tat fighting with Hezbollah, 
Israel launched its ground invasion into southern Lebanon on October 1, 2024, and has since sent thousands of troops into the rugged terrain. Israel's war against Hezbollah, the Iran-backed militant group, stretches far inside Lebanon, and its airstrikes in recent weeks have killed more than 1,700 people, about a quarter of them women and children, according to local health authorities. Some of the more than 50 Israelis killed by Hezbollah over the past year were hit by anti-tank missiles.